On England's south coast, three monster dump trucks need to ride a boat to South Africa. These brand new machines, fresh off the production line, must arrive in perfect condition. But it's touch and go whether they can get on board. Reversing a truck this wide onto a narrow ramp is dicey. Telling the driver to turn his wheel a little bit, there's very confined space and I don't want big movements. The ramp onto Ho Jetta's cargo deck is at an angle, which makes an already tight maneuver even more difficult. But with a clearance of just a few inches on the cargo door, this truck barely squeezes on board. That's a nice noise. That is a nice noise when it stops. All three dump trucks are safely on board, but the four-week voyage to South Africa passes the Bay of Biscay off the coast of France, notoriously a bumpy ride. 19-foot high waves are forecast. Ships have been known to roll as much as 45 degrees and more, and you still want the cargo to stay in position while uh, you're in rough weather. In order to survive the crossing, each 75-ton dump truck will need heavy reinforcements. If cargo shifts, it all shifts in the same direction, which can cause critical imbalances on the boat, potentially causing it to capsize. So lashing the vehicles is crucial. The red bands around, these are strapping the units down to the deck, making sure it's not allowed to move. Rule of thumb is we secure it with a force to each side of the unit that equals the weight of the unit. This one's basically 70 tons. We lash it for 75 tons. So that's going to mean 15 lashings on every side. So 30 lashings. So it's going gonna, it's gonna to look a little bit like a spider web. Supervisors make final checks. Each lashing must have just the right amount of tension. Too slack and the cargo could potentially slip. With a bit of tightening here and there, they've braced the trucks for the rough seas ahead. And now they're off to Durban. The Southampton crew clear the decks. And the vessel and her 22,500 tons of cargo embark on their rocky ride. <laughs> 